Hello everyone, uh, welcome to kundanstech.com. In this tutorial of Windows tips and tricks, we will see how to lock a particular application for a user. If you don't want other users to use an application and use it only for yourself, then you can uh, do so in Windows by using a utility software called App Locker. First thing is you need to create a standard user so that other people can log into your computer by using that standard user a standard user is that type of user who has the authority to use programs use internet and uh, use uh, messaging services but the standard user does not have authority to make changes to the windows securities or to install and uninstall a program if a standard user tries to install a program then the standard user should enter the administrator password so that he can do so or he or she can do so so first thing is you need to create a standard user and let the other users use your computer by using the standard user so once you create a standard user and then the other people they will log into your computer by using the standard user then after that you need to download an application from internet that is called app locker you can download that one from download.com after you download the application then install the application locker app locker whenever you are installing this app locker then you need to provide the administrative privilege or administrator password to install this program so as an administrator you should at first install this app locker in a standard user then once you install the app locker run this program now you need to enter the administrative password in order to run this computer so only the administrator can run this application if everyone else will be able to run this application then anyone can lock and unlock the program so as an administrator you should only have the authority to run this program after entering the password click on yes button now you can see a list of programs which are there in here if you want to lock any of the program then you just need to put a tick mark if I, so for example i want to lock this notepad i click on this one then click on save and click on close button now let me try to run this notepad application i'll go to all programs i'll go to accessories and and then i'll go to notepad now when i try to open this notepad or when any any of the standard user tries to open this notepad then they will get a message like this that they cannot open this notepad application so in this way you can lock a program by using this app locker now when i run this application by using this administrator password i can see that there are only a few programs which are there in this list what if you want to add some other programs then you can edit add uh, the other programs in this list for example i just want to log this skype program so that no one else can use it then i'll just click on this configure button when i click on configure button i have two text box here one is the caption that is i have to write the name or the title of this program then i have to in the other box i have to type the exe uh, exe name of that skype program so for caption i can just write like skype now in order to know the executable file name of this program i will right click on this program and click on properties then we can see in this start in text box there is skype so let me copy this one then 
I'll just type here, paste that one here and add exe so this will be the executable file name for this application similarly if you want to view the executable file name for this hot spot shield just right click on it click on properties and in target box you can see hsscp.exe so this is the this will be the executable file name for this hot spot shield if i want to look for this adobe reader i will right click on it i'll click on properties and i will check in target it is acro rd32.exe similarly for this one skype i will right click on it click on properties and in this case it's skype so once i will enter the executable file name then i'll click on add button then i'll click on ok now i can see that there is a skype program listed here so i'll just click on this one click on save and close button now let me try to run this program here i can see an error error message it shows me that i cannot run this skype program so this is how you will you are able to lock a particular program for a standard user by using this app locker you can add any programs to the list and lock that program thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel